2K Sports welcomes you to the following presentation of the NBA. The Golden State squad coming through the tunnel earlier with the Warriors faithful anxiously awaiting their arrival on the court. Point Tower above San Francisco on a wonderful afternoon. The city hosting tonight's broadcast. We have arrived at Game 4 of the Western Conference Semifinals. And we're set to bring you all the action right here on 2K Sports. With Grant Hill and Steve Smith, I'm Brian Anderson. Allie LaForce is our reporter. Allie, take it away. Brian, as the NBA pivots away from the post and towards the perimeter, we're seeing more teams employ three-guard lineups to great effect, trading some size for skill. We'll see if the trend continues, but guys, for now, it seems that even if there's only one ball, having multiple ball handlers can be very effective. Very interesting, Allie. Good stuff there. Thank you. Now the starting group for the visitors. We've got Zion Williamson, Kyle Lowry out there with Alec Burks. Then it's Brandon Ingram. And for Golden State, Curry and Thompson are the one and the two. Eric Paschal is out there with Andrew Wiggins. And it's Wiseman in at the center position. to start out. Wiggins against Ingram. Pass to Wiseman. Going inside. Can't hit that one. Williamson against Pascal. Back to Lowry. Williamson outside. This one for three. And that's good. His first bucket of the game. You gotta love a veteran point guard. Lowry keeping his eyes up and his options open. Now here's Wiseman. So it'll be two free throws. He was fouled in the act of shooting. That's his first personal foul, first team foul. At the line for the Warriors, James Wiseman. Two shots. First one at the line is good. And so he makes both from the line. And here's Lowry. Outside Burks. To Lowry. It's rebounded by Golden State. Thompson finds Pascal. That one goes. Counting. Making a statement here early. One point. Right to the rack. Oh, I love it. Well, this is his game. Be proactive offensively. Put the defense back on his heels. Now here's Lowry. Knock loose. Outside Burks. Six to shoot. First quarter and about a minute and a half in. Burks against Curry. With the drive. Tipped. To the inside. Williamson. Oh, the dunk by Williamson. We see it night after night. Zion, relentless assault on the cup. Burks against Thompson. Pass to Curry. They double-team Curry. Wiseman with it. From deep three-point range. Rebounded by Ingram. He didn't make them pay for that weak defense, but they just can't rely on him to miss those kind of shots. 
To the middle. And there's Williamson on the assist by Ingram. Williamson's got seven points. Great ball movement by B.I. Spots a wide open teammate and feeds him. Curry passes to Thompson. Now Pascal covered by Williamson. Clock at six. Here's Curry. Here's Pascal. Played it in with a nice touch off the window. Just taking it right to the rim. And no one was there to greet him. Wow, that's a defensive breakdown. Can't do that against good scores. Now here's Burks. And here's Ingram outside. Can't get his first shot of the game to fall. Pascal finds Curry. Got it. Good job in the low post. The defense trying to smother Steph Curry, but he's committed to getting his shot off. Lowry, the pass to Burks. Now Ingram. Lowry outside. Good work defensively by Wiseman. I mean, you won't see this too often. Getting denied at the rim. He's likely to remember that one. Seattle has gone one for two from beyond the arc in this first quarter. Williamson with it. Now Thompson defending. And so he draws the foul, headed to the line to shoot a pair. That's his it's on Alec Burks. Foul. I love Clay Thompson's attitude tonight. At it's why defenders double. tend to make mistakes Clay trying Thompson. to guard him. At the line for two. First one falls for him. You've got to love Clay Thompson's work ethic. He's an elite scorer, but he's no slouch on the other end of the floor as well. He gives you his all. Both free throws good from Thompson. The Supersonics have gone three of six since the tip. Ingram against Wiggins. Ingram, the pass to Lowry. They get it back. And that one is hammered home! <laughs> Crashes the glass with authority, then puts it back strong. Next level, man. This guy's just going out and making a play. Now here's Wiggins. Boy, he's been patient so far. Nothing yet on the scoreboard. Blocked! And it's out of bounds. The Warriors able to retain possession here. How about that strong defensive performance for this half's mobile one block? Oh, you could feel the playoff intensity in that block. He's playing some extra aggressive defense out there. Six on the shot clock. And he gets that one. So polished from this painted area. Love watching Wiggins do his thing close to the basket. Boy, they'd love if anyone could get a bucket. Yeah, their offense has been grinding to a halt. The basket counts and one. He'll go to the line, a chance at a three-point play. You want to run your offense through him. A reliable scoring option. Throw good from Ingram with 
continued hard work. Brandon Ingram, in my opinion, has the talent and size and skill to be a top 10 player in this league. Now here's Curry. Here's Wiseman. And it's good. Assisting on the play was Curry. When they get their opportunity to punch it inside, they don't hesitate. Ingram up top, pounded by Wiggins. Lowry outside. Oh, no good. Had a chance to take the lead. I mean, he's staying aggressive, trying to regain his touch. But right now, he's hurting the team. The three from Curry. Williams grabs the board. And the defense got away with one there. I mean, that's a shot he typically makes. And he lobs it up to the rim. Alley oop on top. Hammer at home. Nearly unstoppable. No matter where the pass is delivered, Zion will go up and get it. And a deep three from Curry. This is another, just one of four from the floor. For Seattle, they've gone six of 11 so far. Here's Lowry. He's in his comfort zone. Two for two to start this one. Have to take care of the defensive boards better than that. Reason why, lack of focus, lack of communication, which led to second chance points. Now here's Thompson. Outside Curry, there's the three. He drops it from range. Curry's got five now. Way to rise to the occasion and snatch back the momentum. That's the competitor in him. Close game. Let me have this one. Lowry against Curry. Outside Ingram. And there's Williamson on the assist by Ingram. 11 points in the game. They have laid on him all quarter, and it has worked to perfection. Golden State calls timeout. <laughs> and we'd all love to hear what goes on in those huddles, but we just get the snapshots. No, we're left to infer from the adjustments we see on the floor. Get on your feet and welcome your Warriors. of the game. You don't want to let him get into a rhythm from out there. The Warriors trailing. Now here's Barnes. And there's the drive. Oh, he got him with a pump fake, but he couldn't finish. Seattle has gone 2 of 5 from beyond the arc in the first quarter. Here's Lewis. Sometimes, with that much of a height advantage, resistance is futile. Golden State is gone only one of four from three-point land. Pass to Poole, and they get it. Gets the three to fall. This is the shot you want to get him. An open look from range. Ingram with the ball. Here he goes. And a slam dunk by Ingram. 
Defenders tried to be physical and knock Ingram off his path, but he typically stays under control. Here's Poole. Uses the glass to finish the layup. Poole's got his second basket on the night. That's a well-timed, well-coordinated play. Comes right off the pitch for the lay-in. Outside Ingram. Guarded by Poole. That shot off. So Golden State will take it the other way. Golden foul. That's his first personal foul. Third team foul. Checking in for the away team, LaMarcus Aldridge. Here's Poole. He's got five. Two minutes remaining in the first. Two minutes. Oh, a clear foul the there on the missed shot. McKee so he'll get a pair Andrew at the line. That's his first personal foul. Team's fourth. At the line for the Warriors, Jordan Poole. Taking two shots. First free throw is good. So good, so he hits both free throws. It's not luck that he's so steady at the line. It's through repetition and hard work. Here's Alexander Walker, guarded by Poole. Alexander Walker with the bucket. 141 left now in the first quarter. Barnes with it. Oh, no scoring yet from him, but that's likely to change. Pool outside. And so it looks like the Warriors will retain possession here. Warriors ball. on the clock. It's stolen by Ingram. The pull up Jay. It's wide right. Hits off the rim. You won't see him miss that one too many times. Yes, let's look on the bright side. You got a great look. It's a play that you might want to go back to again. Here's Lewis. He's guarded by Barnes. And here's Ingram from the arc. Drains it. Now he's three for five. Coming consistent from beyond the arc. It's completely changed how you have to defend Ingram. Pass to Thompson. Over Ingram. They get the rebound. And that's okay. Even though you miss, you had the right guy taking the shot. Here's Lewis. Back to Ingram. Outside. Just five on the clock. There's Alexander Walker. And it's out of bounds. Last touch by Zeller. Away team basketball. Substitution for the away team. Twenty seconds left in the first quarter here. Ingram against Thompson. Shot clock at six. Pass to Alexander Walker. Pulls it. Here's Aldridge. And good work on the boards as they picked up the second chance points. A terrific offensive rebounder. Aldridge definitely knows what to do with it when he gets it. A free-flowing first quarter. Great scoring through one. They're up by eight. And we'll be back in just a minute with the start of the second quarter.
And we've seen the development of Andrew Wiggins in Golden State. He says it's been a great environment to learn. The rest of my team love to teach. The good player, they're always telling us why we did it, why you should do this, why you should do that. So it's been a lot of learning and also been very exciting uh, for the young players. Grant Wiggins seems to be taking that next step. Yes, he is. I mean, the former number one overall pick. With a fresh start, some of that pressure is off. Doesn't have to be a star. His best is good enough. Continuing our coverage of the Western Conference semifinals. Glad to have you back. And what do you guys think about the visitors here in this one? Well, I'm really loving their activity. I mean, they're contesting shots. They've really set a strong tone early. And you can oh, see it's down. already having an impact. It can cause down. shooters to first think twice. Down. Zeller, pass to Barnes. It's out of bounds. The Warriors able to retain possession here. Thompson outside. Pure from three-point range. Thompson's got five now. Defensively, you have to stay connected to play, or he'll drop these all night long. Pass to Aldridge. Here's Alexander Walker. The jumper from the wing off target. Went to the fadeaway. Didn't need to, though. Probably cost him some points. Here's Poole. Oh, and he got fouled on his way up. He'll head to the line to shoot two. That's his second. Yeah, you never foul. want to let shots at the rim go uncontested. At the line for the dubs, Jordan. Two shots. First one falls, and the Warriors making a switch here. Wiggins is checked in. And he makes both free throws. Quarter number two with just over a minute of play. Here's Alexander Walker. He takes it in. Outside Ingram. Pass to Aldridge. From the low block. Second shot opportunity. And the basket is good. He got it to go and he took the bump. So a free throw coming up. An opportunity at a three-point play. Burks, he's checked in for Ingram. Shooting one. Golden State has gotten three of their seven threes to find the net in this matchup. Close the net on two minutes played here in the second. Outside Curry. Wiseman, pass to Pascal. Four on the clock. The three from Curry. And again, no good by Golden State. And they just continue to dominate the board. On the wing, Burks. Alexander Walker launches it. Warriors with the rebound. And the ball goes out of bounds. Last touch by Wiggins. 
<laughs> Lowry <laughs> has checked in for Alexander Walker. Yeah, wow. For Seattle, they've gotten two of five shots to fall this second quarter. Pass to Aldridge. Up top, Lowry. Pascal defends. Lowry, good. Their interior D continues to look shaky. Not a good matchup for them right now. Second quarter play, almost three minutes gone here. Outside Curry. And the officials will call the illegal screen here. One of the trickier plays to judge, but it would be hard to argue against the call. It's often a tough call that can go either way, but I agree with you on that one. The Supersonics have got three of six shots to go here in the second quarter. Lowry with it. Now Pascal defending. Inside. Drops in the layup for two. Aldridge has got four points this quarter. We've seen that more than once today. An effortless basket inside. Barnes passes to Curry. Oh, he's way off from outside. <laughs> I'll tell you what, they've rebounded the ball tremendously well. Burks against Wiggins. With his first shot attempt. Can't get his first shot of the game to fall. The Warriors have gotten only one of four shots to go in. Pascal from outside sends it home from three-point land. Pascal's got seven points in the game. Not just a knockdown shooter. He does a great job of finding space for his shot. Back to Burks. Pass to Brand. Aldridge left side. And here is Burks. Shot clock at five. There's the drive. Called in by Curry. Mm, I'm not sure what happened on that play. They have relaxed a little bit once he got to the rim. And the Warriors with another three. I love the way they're spacing the floor this quarter. Their three-point percentage has really gone up. Pass to Brand. to Lowry. Burks with it. Now Williamson. 11 points in the game. Ooh, rejected by Wiseman. And there's the shot clock violation. Couldn't get the shot off in time. Coming on to the floor for the away team. Golden State has got five of 11 threes to drop so far in this game. Curry passes to Wiggins. Back to Curry. Shoots over Burks. That one a tad offline, but it drops in for him. Ten points for him. We all prefer to watch Steph Curry shoot a three, but he can really shoot the mid-range jumper. Pass to Lewis. Lowry. Now here's Wiggins. To the paint. And a slam dunk by Pascal. What a look from Steph Curry. Just shredding defenses with pinpoint passes to open teammates. And here's Lowry. Williamson outside. Outside Burks. Pass to Lewis. Here's Lowry. Three-pointer. And it's Wiseman with the rebound. He really can't buy a bucket, but his teammates have his back. Here's Barnes. That one's good. This game is all even. 
Barnes has got his first basket of the night. They're punishing those late defensive rotations, getting good looks inside throughout the half. It's time to talk this over and try to put a stop to this run. Because right now, it feels like the pace is being dictated to them. They need to go back to playing their brand of basketball. This is what you get with Lowry, a confident shooter in these situations. Wiggins with it. Now here's Wiseman. Outside Barnes. Clock at six. Three-pointer. Drains the triple. Barnes has got five now. And boy, has this been a competitive matchup thus far. These teams have swapped leagues seven times already. We're not even in the second half. Here's Lewis. Works for three. Knocks down the long J. Burks has gotten himself going here. His first points of the game on the deep ball. Curry finds Wiggins. Now Barnes. The layup misses. This has been a close game in a lot of ways, but they do have an edge on the boards. Here's Lowry. Williamson left side. Pass to Lewis. Fires for three. Drills it from deep. He has six. Staying unselfish, keeping your eyes up. So important for a young player. Zion, mature beyond his years. Now here's Wiseman. Back to Curry. From deep. And they get it back. And yep, it's good. Wiseman's got his second basket of the night. And they're in a better flow this quarter offensively. And their shooting percentage is steadily rising as a result. Curry against Lowry. Misses the mark there. Just two for ten for the game. Up top, Pascal. It's deflected. Lowry outside. On the wing, Burks. Pounded by Wiggins. Here's Lewis. And the shot counts. He's fouled. And it's a chance for a three-point play. Shooting for the away team. At the line for one. State has gone four of seven from three during the second quarter. Thompson passes to Zeller. This is the fadeaway. Risky strategy here. I mean, shifting their offense more to the outside. Mm, we'll see. Here's Lewis. Warriors with the rebound. The layup is good off the glass. You can tell Clay's played in an offense that emphasized spacing and ball movement. Ingram against Thompson. And he was fouled while in the act of shooting, so he'll take two free throws. That's his first. Clay Thompson picks one up. At the line for the away team, Brandon Ingram taking two shots.
he makes a first. Both free throws good from Ingram. I love it. In attack mode. Drawing foul calls this quarter and getting to the free throw line. It's stolen. And they're on the run. Pulls up for three. Connects from downtown. Ingram. Ingram's got five points in the quarter. He drops yet another dive. Just facilitating this offense like a maestro. Here's Curry. Pass to Zeller. And they'll get another chance. Back to Curry. Down to five on the shot clock. Second chance shot. Count it. Now five of 11 for the game. Phenomenal screen and roll player because of his ball handling ability. Comes off the screen, makes the right play. Bucket. Here's Lewis. And the ball is tied up, so we'll have a jump ball. Four seconds left in the half. Started by Poole. Pass to Alexander Walker. Zeller with the rebound. Zeller's got four rebounds now. Thompson passes to Curry. the three offensive rebound and it's good but hang on here the officials may want to take a look at it on the replay monitor well these teams are going to have to wait before heading to the locker room they're going to bring out the monitor and see if he got it off in time and the video is going to be sent to the officials from the replay center in Sakaka it looked like he got it off in time though And after reviewing the play, it looks like they're overturning the call here. That basket is good. It would have been a real shame if those points didn't count. I'm so glad the officials were able to take a second look and make the right call. And so a close game as we wrap up the first half of play. They're up by four. Well, now we have some time to check in with Allie LaForce. Allie. Here with Coach Steve Kerr, your defense struggling to contain them in the first half. How do you remedy it? We got to uh, get back in transition, but we got to make them feel us. You know, they're just running anything they want. We've got to at least disrupt the stuff they're trying to do. Thank you, Coach. Appreciate it, Allie. And we'll be coming right back after this break, ready for the third quarter. The 2K Sports Halftime Show. Taking a look at the Supersonics, they've got their biggest half of the season coming up. They cannot afford to fall into a 3-1 hole in this series. If there was ever a time to pull out all the stops, now would be it. How about you, Kenny? What did you think about the visiting team? Well, if you compare the assist numbers, you can see who's been the superior team. And they're playing a much better brand of basketball. That bodes well for them the rest of the way. And Shaq, what do you have to say about the Warriors? Well, their poor rebounding is really hurting them. It hasn't killed them on the scoreboard yet, but they need to pick it up. This is a game they can win. If they come out hustling in the second half, they can win. And we 
welcome you back to Game 4, folks. Thanks for joining us. Boy, this has been one outstanding game from Brandon Ingram. Well, tonight is a big game, and you have to be impressed with the way he's come out firing. He's one of those players who can turn up when necessary, and you need those guys in big games. Seattle has gone 6 for 12 from deep so far in this game. Play at the 2 with Wiggins at the 3. Eric Paschal is out there with Wiseman. And it's Curry in at the point guard position. That's the Warriors 5. We know Ingram's capable of having big nights, but now we're seeing it more and more and more. Here's Curry. That one goes in. Curry's got 14. Probably a play they drew up in the locker room at half. Listen, put the ball in the hands of your best scorers and let them go to work. Keep it simple. Now here's Ingram. With the teardrop. Rebound by Wiggins. The Warriors trailing. Here's Pascal. Doesn't go for him. Good D by Williamson. Pass to Lowry. Second half rolling along, about a minute played here. Ingram against Pascal. Just four to shoot. And the basket by Williamson. 13 points in the game. We talk about Zion's strength, but the body control is also elite, especially for a guy this size. Here's Curry. Counted. That's his seventh basket of the game in 14 tries. And he was dominant in their last outing. And the same thing here tonight. He is in a terrific group right now. Here's the thing. He's a guy who will go on hot streaks for you over a number of games. Thompson outside. Pass to Wiggins. Let's the three fly. He can't get it to go. And this is exactly who you want taking that shot. He just missed it. Burke's no good. The Warriors have gotten two of four shots to go since the break. Down low. Here's Wiseman. And it's Wiseman with the jam. Making sure of it with the two-hand slam, B.A. Yeah, I don't blame him. With the score this tight, you cannot take a chance here. Outside England. That's good. And so Lowry with the assist. From Lowry's got his fourth assist in this one. The Warriors have gone three of five from the field in this third quarter. Curry with it. He's picked up by Williamson. Out to Thompson. The three is up. And the three-pointer goes. Thompson's got eight. There's that signature jumper. Clay Thompson with the picture-perfect mechanics. Pass to Burks. Lowry outside. Ingram with the ball. Let's it go from deep. The rebound by Wiggins. Wiggins got his fourth rebound in this one. Not in rhythm. He had the two triples in the first half. None so far in the second. And looks like an illegal pick was set. That gets the ref's attention. That's just being out of sync. And at the worst time, costly. Defense doesn't get much better than the mobile one block we just saw on replay. You know that block has him and his teammates all pumped up. That is what Chicken playoff basketball is all about. LaMarcus Aldridge. The Supersonics have gotten four of seven shots to drop in the third. Burks against Thompson. Burks passes to Ingram. Back to Burks. Puts up a three. And Pascal secures it. Golden State has got seven of their 16 three-point attempts to go in. That ties it up. Wiggins has got a second bucket of the night. As the deep shots continue to fall, you can sense the frustration growing among these defenders. Pass to Aldridge. And here's Ingram from deep three-point range. Wiseman with the rebound. Wiseman's got six rebounds here tonight. Thompson passes to Curry. Now here's Wiggins. 
Six to shoot. And that's a foul called on Stephen Curry. That's his first foul. And this kind of selflessness is great to see. Textbook positioning to draw the charge. Barnes, he's checked in for Stephen Curry. Outside Burks for three. And that comes off the assist by Lowry. Burks has got six points. That's where Burks has shown he can be efficient shooting the ball with the catch and release. Here's Wiggins. And there's another one for the Warriors. Look at how they've come out in the second half. It's almost like night and day. In this half, a more entertaining one. The pace is picked up. Tougher defense. Better ball movement. Now here's Burks. Six points for him. Lowry, the pass to Burks. Here's Ingram, pounded by Wiggins. From the wing, the shot by Ingram, no good. The Warriors have gotten six of eight shots to go and looking good since the break. Barnes, chance there to take the lead, but a miss. For Seattle, they've gone 5 of 11 in this third quarter. Pass to Lowry. Aldridge with it. Over Barnes. Warriors with the rebound. Wiseman's got seven rebounds in the game. Thompson outside for the lead. Aldridge pulls down the board. Seattle has gone only one of four from three-point land in the third quarter. Outside Burks. Pass to Lowry. And here's Williamson. Haskell defends. The turnaround. Williamson, no good. Once he gets the ball there, you expect him to capitalize. That was a missed opportunity. Barnes passes to Wiseman. Outside Pascal. Wiggins with it. Oh, and there's a one-hand jam. Here in the second half, this game's still nip and tuck. Just an insane amount of lead changes. The fans are getting their money's worth. Seattle has got seven of their 16 three-point attempts to go in. It may be a player's league, but the coaches obviously play a big part as well. Yeah, if that weren't the case, you wouldn't see so many coaching changes in the offseason. Get up on your feet and welcome your Warriors 15. so far about the offensive approach for the Warriors. They've turned in a fantastic performance from three-point range. That's been a weapon for them all game. And another thing, they're doing a great job of getting inside and converting around the rim. I really love their aggressiveness. Here's Ingram. 17 points in the game. Pass to Aldridge. Aldridge is doubled. And a bit of a battle for the ball. And the official signal a jump ball here. And here 
far the Warriors now. The Warriors have gone 8 of 12 from the floor in the third quarter. Pass to Poole. Zeller with the ball. He's covered by Aldridge. Zeller with pass to Barnes. Takes a 13-footer. And too long on the shot. Seattle has gotten only one three-pointer to fall here in the third. Five attempts to win the run. And he's going to the line for two. The official saw contact while he was going up. Team foul. Shooting for the away team, Nikhil Alexander-Walker. Two shots. down the first one. Good on both. Barnes with it. Five points in the game. Pass to Zeller. Up top, Wiggins. Oh, blocked by Ingram. Wonderful defense from Ingram. Good to see him using his length to alter shots. Well, he keeps taking shots and keeps missing. At what point do you get others involved? Now here's Wiggins. He's got nine. They get it back. Here's Zeller. And finally, they hit one. Zeller. Zeller's got his second basket. Defensively, they've got to get more bodies in the paint. That's three straight field goals from below the free throw line. Burks passes to Aldridge. Count the basket and the foul. It's going to go on Cody Zeller. I love the body control to take the hit. Still convert. Aldridge now going to the line for one shooting more. For the away team, Lamarcus Aldridge shooting one. And that one falls for Aldridge. He's a big man you do not want to send to the line. LaMarcus is over 80% for his career. Now Poole, 12 points for him. Aldridge pulls down the board. Here's Alexander Walker. Shoots over Barnes. And good as it takes a nice bounce off the right iron and down. Alexander Walker's got the second bucket on the night. Poole, the pass to Zeller. Outside Barnes. Pass to Wiggins. Six on the shot clock. Sinks that one. Now shooting five of ten. Looking sharp. What a turnaround for him since the half. More aggressive and more effective. with it. Outside for Ingram. One forty-four left in the third. Misses in close. <laughs> the battle of the boards has been something to watch. It's Poole on the wing. Defended by Burks. Poole, the pass to Zeller. Goes back up. The layup is good. Zeller's got four points in the quarter. <laughs> They're not messing around. Five of their last six buckets have come from the interior. Here's Alexander Walker. Outside Ingram. Pass to Alexander Walker. Tries again. No luck on that one. 
The Warriors go the other way with it. 52 seconds left in the third quarter. And here's Barnes. He's got five. Two for three. Aldridge pulls down the board. Aldridge has got five rebounds in the game. To the middle. Here's Alexander Walker. And that's good. Off the glass that time. Alexander Walker's got eight points. The defense couldn't collapse quickly enough. About seven seconds separating the shot and game clocks. Wiggins outside. Counted from distance. Wiggins has got 12 points here in the second half. This demonstrates assertiveness. You know Wiggins is feeling it when he's rising and firing like this. Here's Alexander Walker. Give him eight points now. Soft touch off the glass. He's got ten. Not just selling for something along the perimeter. Excellent job. We're at the end of the third quarter, and we've still got a close one. The Warriors on top, up two. And we're coming right back. Be sure to stay with us as we get set for quarter number four. a moment now as we take a look at our State Farm assist of the game. You know, I'm kind of stoked this was a choice because I love this pass. A remarkable find. He put his court vision on full display. Yeah, you also have the location of the pass. Puts it right where it needs to be, where his man can do something with it. We've reached the fourth quarter in what has been a very competitive game. Should be an exciting finish. They've got Alec Burks, Brandon Ingram out there with the Marcus Aldridge. Then it's Nikhil Alexander-Walker. I don't know what Coach told him at halftime, but he is shooting the lights out right now. Now here's Ingram. Ingram on the wing. by Wiggins. Curry passes to Wiggins. And it's good. Assisting on the play was Curry. Curry's got his fourth assist with that last one. Very consistent tonight at the offensive end. Right there, he helps fuel the fire. Now here's Ingram. Back to Burks. Oh, rejected by Wiggins. Nice rebound. Trying to match the other team's intensity right now. The reverse slam. That was sweet. Ah, the finesse on full display. Pass to Aldridge. Out of bounds. It'll go to the Warriors. Golden State basketball. Checking in for the whole team. Warriors leading. Outside Curry. First minute and a half of basketball played here in the fourth. And Kyle Lowry is going to pick up the foul. That's his first foul of the game. And the Warriors with possession here. And that one's good. Weissman. likes this effort level. They need to refocus. It's so easy to get run over when you lose even a little edge. Look for them to come out much more aggressive.
let's send it over to Allie LaForce. Hey guys, over that break, I was able to catch the message that the visiting team coach was giving to his team. He let his guys know that he needs more from them to close this deficit. He said, quote, we have to get something started. I know we're behind. So you are capable of taking this game if you still want it. Thanks for that, Ali. They just can't get stopped against this guy. Zion, too strong and too athletic. Pass to Wiseman. Ingram against Wiggins. And here's Thompson for three. Another three for Golden State. Wow. Their opponent is doing a tremendous job spacing the floor. Lowry to pass to Ingram. Back to Lowry. To the inside. Williamson. Another shot. And that's two points on the layup. And this team's struggles are not his fault. He's putting in work at the offensive end. Wiggins outside. Driving inside. Great D that time from Williamson. For Seattle, they've gotten half of their attempts to fall in the fourth. Two for four now. Lowry against Curry. Outside Ingram. And Pascal secures it. He's trying to find his shot. But at some point, you have to start making these. Wiggins against Ingram. Inside. Here's Curry. The basket drops. And he gets fouled on the shot. One free throw coming his way. I mean, excellent body control. Steph, a better athlete than some people give him credit for. Burks, he's checked in for Alexander Walker. Second team foul at the line for the Dubs. Stephen Curry. One shot. You know what I appreciate most about Curry is his winning mentality. His competitive nature fuels this team. Here's Lowry. Oh, and makes it with the kiss. Well, the defense allowed that one. He had a clear path to the cup. Golden State has gone three for three from downtown in this fourth quarter. Curry against Lowry. And Pascal gets it to go on the assist from Curry. Curry's got five assists tonight. We played just over three and a half minutes now in the fourth quarter. Outside Burks. Back to Lowry. Pass to Williamson. Outside Burks. Shot clock at six to the paint. And he takes it in for the layup off a very nice feed. He has to show real leadership out there and take this game into his own hands because he's shooting the ball well. The Warriors have gone seven of eight in this fourth quarter. Curry against Lowry. Curry's shot is off. For Seattle, they've gone four of seven from the field in the fourth quarter. And out of bounds. The Warriors will take it. They put together a solid lead. And it doesn't seem like they're going to back off. Thompson passes to Wiseman. Wiggins outside. Back to Wiseman. Clock at six. Let's it fly. Wiggins no good. Seattle has gone seven for 17 from three-point range so far in this matchup. Pascal against Lowry. Pass to Williamson. Post it goes. Williamson's got 19. The Warriors shooting 51%. Good clip from the field. Pascal against Williamson. Here's Wiggins. And that one's good. Wiggins has got seven points here in the quarter. A tale of two halves. He's really turned it around here. 
scoring the ball. And he got the whistle on the way up. So he'll be headed to the line for a pair. When he gets it to the lane, Kyle Lowry is so hard to predict, which is why he'll get to the line so often. the away team, Kyle Lowry. At the line for two. Free throw good from Lowry. You know, it's easy to see why Kyle Lowry has racked up so many all star selections over his career. His leadership on the floor and his willingness to fight for every play is truly exceptional. It's both from the stripe, and they've done well from the free throw line this half. No misses yet. Burks against Thompson, and play stops. A whistle there on what looks like an illegal screen. There it is on a night when he's been so efficient hounding the basketball. That's his first real mistake. For Seattle, they've gone five of eight from the field so far in the fourth. Williamson passes to Ingram. Back to Williamson. Side Ingram from deep kept alive. I love the relentless attitude he showed there. Got himself in great position under the glass. He had the presence of mind to know exactly where the rebound was going. Now here's Curry up and over Lowry, and again it's Golden State. The whole team is loving everything Steph is doing. Glenn with the ease on offense tonight. Here's Ingram, and he gets it to go. Ingram's got 19. So it's the Warriors now. They've led by as many as 14. Here's Curry. Count that bucket. And the Warriors lead by 10. He is at a different level when you start talking about handling the basketball. One of the best to ever do it. Outside Burks. To the inside. Here's Williamson. And there it is for him. He's got 21. I admired the defender's ambition, but Zion's artful work inside gets him the shot. Here's Curry driving in. Oh, and there's the whistle on the shot. So two free throws for him coming up. second foul. No debate there. He got him. At the line for the Warriors, Stephen Curry. At the line for two. And that one falls for Curry. So Curry nails both of them. And really strong at the line since the break. The Supersonics have gone 8 of 12 so far here in the fourth. Outside Burks. Ingram up top. Hounded by Wiggins. Burks for three. And the rebound goes to the Warriors. He's had a tough time getting it going. And he's put this team behind the eight ball. And it's Weissman with the chance. A few more points to their lead, showing off some style. Wow, that was prime time stuff right there. Now here's Lowry. Oh, the dunk by Williamson. The pass, the catch, the slam. What a clean play. And absolutely jaw dropping. Here's Thompson. Back to Curry. The three is up. Yes, and a nice assist from Thompson. Thompson's got his fourth assist in this one. This has been a tremendous quarter for him. Everything he puts up now looks like it's going in. Man, it's been quite a game for Stephen Curry. Good decision to regather. Talk it over. Your main concern now is how to slow this guy down on the offensive end.
gentlemen, your Warriors dance team. our New Balance player of the game, Stephen Curry. This is special. We are witnessing a legendary performance here tonight. He is like levels above everyone else on the floor. Something must have clicked for him in warm-ups tonight. He's just come out and he has run wild. Yeah, this is something he will remember forever. These types of performances in the playoffs are what define a player's legacy. Now here's Lowry. To the middle. Tipped. Now here's Wiggins. Curry passes to Pascal. No good on the three. <laughs> and I'm surprised that didn't go down. I mean, I'm sure he is too. Williamson with it. Now Wiggins defending. Back to Williamson. Oh, the dunk by Williamson. Strong performance from him. But he may need to do even more if they're going to win this game. Curry with it. Pass to Thompson. That drops, and it comes off an assist from Curry. Thompson's got six in the quarter. Here in the second half, they're really focused on stretching the floor. This was obviously a focal point coming out of the break. Looks smart, so the shots are going down. But he might lack in height at the four spot. He makes up for it with his burst. One forty-six left to play in the fourth quarter. And there's the call. It's going to be an illegal screen. Well, the league has put an emphasis to crack down on illegal screens. Yes, the last few years, the rules changes have tended to benefit the offenses. This evens things out a bit. Now here's Lowry. Pass to Williamson. The jump hook. That went off the back iron and out. And the Warriors shooting 54% from the field so far in this one. Here's Thompson. And that'll be Golden State's ball as it goes out of bounds. Warriors able to keep possession. Wiggins on the wing, covered by Ingram. Six to shoot. Wiggins passes to Thompson. Another three for Golden State. With the time running down here in game four, we've got to give credit to what a terrific performance it's been for the Warriors. And the huge difference today, the efficiency from beyond the arc. <laughs> yeah, once they started hitting shots, it stretched out the D and opened up the entire offense. And we get spoiled sometimes, but we should take a second to appreciate what a sensational performance this has been for Stephen Curry. Throughout the night, he was their catalyst at the offensive end. Play after play was run through him with great success. It's good on the putback. And he's now got the double-double. He really gets in perfect position for the follow. Just a terrific read. Pass to Wiggins. The rebound by Burks. Two second difference between shot and game clock. Here's Williamson. And a foul called on the way up. So he'll take two from the free throw line. That's his second personal foul. That'll be on Eric Pascal. Look at Zion's agility. He makes a tricky adjustment to get the shot off. Taking two shots. Williamson hits them both. And here are the Warriors now. Now Poole. And so it's the Warriors taking care of business in this one. And with this win, they'll jump out to a 3-1 lead in the series. A commanding start. And they can't afford to take their foot off the gas pedal. The job isn't done yet, but it's close to being all she wrote. All right, now let's check in with Allie LaForce. Allie, what do you have? 
I'm here now with Clay Thompson and Clay congratulations on the win. How satisfying is it winning games in front of this devoted crowd. Well we always want to put on a show for our fans. They deserve it. They show up every single night and uh, it's just fun to protect home court. It's one of the best places to play in the league no doubt. Thanks Clay. Allie thank you as always. Time for us to say goodbye. We hope you enjoyed our second round coverage of the NBA Western Conference playoffs. So for Grant Hill, Allie LaForce, and Steve Smith, I'm Brian Anderson, thanking everyone for watching tonight's game.